but today about the rule of law. I'm going to talk to you about the rule of law for a couple of reasons. First, it is so deeply, intrinsically intertwined with the goals and the vision of this great organization. Take the free market. You cannot have a free market in the absence of the rule of law. Limited government. Without the rule of law, a government by its very own nature will grow beyond its legitimate powers. So the rule of law is critical. The second reason I want to talk about the rule of law is I'm not going to lie to you. It has been a very tough week in Virginia. Amen. It has been a really tough week in Virginia. And I, I'm a native Virginian, as you heard. I went to law school at UVA, and it's been really tough. And as I have spent hours uh, over the past week thinking about what comes next, it is clear to me that a faithful adherence to the rule of law is critical yes. as we move forward. I'll say something about that um, before I finish. Let's talk about the rule of law. What is it? I'm going to go to uh, James Madison, Federalist 51. If men were angels, no government would be necessary. In framing a government which is to be administered by men over men, the great difficulty lies in this. You must first enable the government to control the governed, and in the next place, oblige it to control itself. Now, speaker designate Cox had you raise your hand if, about your first paycheck. How many people raise your hand think our government is obliging itself to control itself? 